Example 4. Uniform flow occurs in an isosceles triangular channel with apex angle of 80 degrees at a normal depth of 1.6 meters. The roughness coefficient n is 0 0.018. The mean velocity of flow is limited to 1.2 meters per second to avoid scouring effect. So determine the maximum allowable discharge in this channel to avoid scouring effect, the hydraulic mean depth, and the drop in the channel bed per 600 meters length of channel. So this is the section to help analyze the problem. So we draw a line, vertical line through the vertex so that this is 1.6 tangent of 40. Each tangent 40 is opposite over 1.6, so 1.6 tangent of 40. So Q is area times mean velocity. The area is 1.6 tangent of 40 times 2, so 1 half 3.2 tangent 40 times 1.6. 1 half of 3.2 tangent of 40 degrees, that's the top width, times depth of flow 1.6. Then velocity, mean velocity of flow is limited to 1.2, so we maximize 1.2 to prevent scouring effect. So the maximum discharge is 2.578 cubic meter per second. The hydraulic mean depth is simply the hydraulic radius and it is equal to area over wetted perimeter. The area is 2.578 over 1.2 or this area here. The wetted perimeter because this is 1.6 over cosine 40, one slope. So one half of 3.2 tangent 40 times 1.6, that's the area, 2.148 square meter. The wetted perimeter, this is again, the 1.6 over cosine of 40 cosine of 40 degrees is is 1.6 over this land side so the land side is 1.6 over cosine 40 so the wetted perimeter is times 2 of that land side 2 times 1.6 over cosine 40 degrees so the wetted perimeter is 4.177 meters so hydraulic mean depth therefore is 2.148 over 4.177 hydraulic mean depth or hydraulic radius 0.5142 meters then finally the drop in the channel bed per 600 meters length of channel since the flow is uniform the drop in channel bed is also the drop in the energy grade line in other words that's the head loss so we need to solve for the slope slope is because velocity is 1 over hydraulic radius to the two-thirds slope to the one-half. So the slope is n square veloc mean velocity square over hydraulic radius to the four-thirds. So that's the formula. So slope is head loss over length of 600 meters. 0 0.018 n is 0 0.018 square. Then mean velocity 1.2 square over hydraulic radius to the four-thirds. So the head loss or the drop per 600 meters is 0.6795 meters.